What is up everybody, it's Jeremy from Star Trek Systems and today is Thursday and that means Project Cars. Um, I know there was no video last week, uh, I've been really really busy lately so um, that's why that happened. Um, and this week I've been a little bit under the weather so that's why there was no uh, Dirt Rally video on Tuesday. Um, I'm still feeling a little bit under the weather but uh, we should be good to go here today. Um, same as last episode, I did already uh, do the the practices just to get the the track down a little bit um, and make sure that the video is not too long. Um, the first practice it was raining and that kind of sucked, but the second uh, the second practice was bright and sunny. Um, I think I was like four seconds quicker than the second guy at least when I exited out I exited out a little early um, but here we go we are going to jump into qualifying at number one um, hopefully we can get a good good lap pretty quick here so we can skip on over to the second qualifying session right away um, I'm just gonna stay in a higher gear this out lap here just so my tires can uh, I don't get it, man. I know my tires are cold and everything, but, like, I shouldn't be sliding like that. And then these guys are just killing it right off the bat. Um, I've turned quite a few laps on this track, and I actually, I'm on my personal career, I actually started in the, the shifter car carts um and the two the 250 cc super cart class races on this track it's a little bit shorter though um all this is the same that you're seeing right now the only difference is uh coming up right here instead of a chicane to the left it's a chicane to the right and then it goes right to the finish line um so it's a little bit shorter but obviously the uh, shifter carts are smaller, and if they were to do this full course, it, the lap times would be too long. So let's get one clean, perfect lap. See if we can get onto pole position. My tires still aren't warm, but we're gonna go for it anyways. Here, just kidding. One tire is warm now. Sorry for the sniffles once again, I'm still a little bit under the weather, so... Oh man, oh really? Damn, alright, next lap we'll get one. I would have caught this guy anyways, and... Actually, I probably could have passed him down this long straight coming up. Oh boy, almost off track right there. I didn't get the drive, so... I'm a lot quicker through this chicane than the rest of these cars are. Uh, the difficulty is the same as last episode. Mainly because I didn't do good at all uh, the last episode. Actually, scratch it. I think I won the, the sprint race thing. But in the normal race, I sucked ass, so. Oh, this turn always throws me off. Alright, here we go. All the tires are good to go now, so. Should be good. This should be our lap right here. Barring any fuck-ups by me. Like this. That did not count off track. Good. We will be alright. Oh shit! Same thing. I, 
think I'm turning into that corner too early. And I'm drifting way too far out, so. But in practice, or the second practice, I should say, um, I was killing it in that corner. And it's starting to rain, so I better get a good lap here soon. Actually, it's probably been raining a little bit. I just noticed it now. This is what happened in the first practice, actually. But I could tell that it was going to rain. It was really, really cloudy. Um, at least in this qualifying session, there's still some blue sky, so. As you can see, though, the track looks pretty wet. Um, I don't know if I should go for it or if I should just kind of uh, mosey my way around the track. Guess we'll see how it feels here. Uh, yeah, it's getting really slippery. That's really unfortunate because I should have had a, two laps already. There we go. backed off on that corner I did, that corner is really weird to me and this one too because you're going up a hill and then it's a turn like right after you get up the hill so not even a hill just a little bit of elevation all right this could be our lap here we'll hit that pretty clean Sector 2 time. That's what I like to see. Locking up the brakes because it's too wet. This looks like it has a little bit of an off camber too. Well, it's pretty tricky, especially when it's wet. Should be the quickest lap here. Oh, P2, alright. It looks like the rain's dying down. Watch out, bud. And we got three and a half minutes left of qualifying. All right, new sector one time. Which is surprising, even though I hit that other car. I mean, I guess I just kind of used him as a berm, a little buffer. Um, didn't really slow me down too much. Oh, this is it. This is it right here. trying to fuck that corner up. That one's pretty tricky too. I can't tell you how many times my back end kind of just came out uh, exiting that corner. Same here. Like I said last lap, it's a pretty tricky corner to get uh, quickly. So, And there it is. Almost two seconds quicker. <laughs> Alright, so that's going to do it for this qualifying session. We're just going to uh, skip to the end. And we actually didn't even, all right, so we're going to be starting second in the, uh, the sprint race. And here we go for uh, the actual, the three lab race, or it might be four, I don't even remember. We're going to be the second car out. And again, I fucking, I don't know what to do right there. I'm just going to roll around in fifth gear and still probably slide out.
Hopefully my tires warm up before the uh, first time the lap starts. I just want to get a nice lap in here really quick so we can get to the racing. You can dive into this uh, little chicane really quickly. I was hitting it in second uh, when I was first starting uh, the first practice, but it's time on the tr time on any track really. Uh, you now you you can start pushing. You're in the zone. Let's take pole. Once again, why I love racing games. They're just once you get a groove, you can just start pushing everywhere. You just know you can, and it's a pretty sick feeling. All right, here we go. Oh, what a pass! Woo -hoo -hoo. That was a great pass right there. Kind of fucked that corner up. But, uh... Oh, boy. Oh, we're good. Oh, man. I don't know what's happening. I like the edge of the track, but... Gotta be careful. that really well as well and sector two time is mine this could be our lap boys we'll, we'll do one more safe lap just in case Hopefully better this time. So far it looks like that time still remaining the quickest. I think this corner was the, the factor in it. Ooh, I was a tenth quicker through the first sector. I hit that still pretty sketchy, but it was quicker than the first lap, or the first timed lap, I should say. But this sec or this corner a lot better as well. I think I hit that little chicane a lot better as well. Yeah, we're seven tenths up. Locking them up. Oh, I felt it starting to slide out. Good though. Running a little wide on the exit of that turn, but. 124.8. All right, that's gonna do it for this qualifying. I feel confident with that, so we're going to skip to the end of the session. And, yep, three and a half seconds quicker. So, when the track is dry, uh, looks like we're the fastest on the track. When the track is not dry, uh, we might have some issues. So we're starting second, and it's fucking raining. Here we go. Focus on the lights, mate. Let's take him into the first corner. Come on, you can do it. Green, green, green. I think I'm going to stay uh, gear higher than I usually would be. 
Keep the RPMs a little low. I'm gonna try to make a pass. We only got two laps, so you gotta make your passes count. Nope, not gonna do it there, or maybe here. Oh, I got the drive on him. Uh, sorry, bud, but you're going. <laughs> I think he was flipping. Oops. Alright, so we started second and we're back in the second. I don't know if I should be charging into this like I usually do. Oh boy. Ran it a bit deep in that corner. I think I'm still catching this guy though. Uh, once again, sorry for the sniffles. Alright. Lap two of two. Let's see what we can do here. Oh shit. Is he out? Is he done? Nope, he's on my left. I'm halfway on the track. <laughs> Showing him a wheel. Alright, there we go. We got the spot. Had to be a little aggressive, but hey, it's only two laps. You got to do what you got to do. Oh, he's going to have my... Oh, man, he's right up on the back of me. I should get him right here, though. I feel like I uh, charge this a lot harder than any other guy here. Oh, almost too hard though. You're leading by one second. Try and push the gap open. Just gotta have a nice clean corner right here. Okay, we've got a little bit of pressure from the guy behind, so maybe time to start covering the inside line. And that should give me the W right there. Alright. So, the sprint race is mine. Hopefully, uh, the normal race will be mine as well. Hopefully we can go 1-1 on the weekend. Uh, for the first time in the series. So, only by three tenths of a second. We're going to continue on. All right, so despite the uh, the terrible weekend last weekend, um, we're still up by almost 20 points here, 15 to be exact. Um, continue on to race two. Four laps. We've made it to the final race. Go and wrap it up. Green, green, green. Alright, he had a better start, but I have his inside. Nope. I had to give it to him. I, that, because uh, last week, I thought I had the inside, but I ended up getting absolutely annihilated from the guy who started second. So, I'm a little bit more cautious. See if I can get a run in this corner and get him down the sh or just push him off the track. Oopsie. But then third got around me, so still in second. Alright though. Like there's one on your tail. Start defending your position. Cover the inside line and the braking areas. He is all over the back of me. Oh 
for him. He's gonna get me right here. Uh, maybe not. Oh. I know I'm gonna gain on this this uh, car in the lead here in this next corner, right up here. Oh, come on, man. Oh. I didn't know what I was trying to do right there. <laughs> Fuck. Need to get around this guy. Just pushed him off like I did the other, the other car uh, lap ago right there. I need to outbreak him somewhere. Oh, he's right, right here. The line. No, oh, boy. No, nope. not quite. Almost. They do not give you an inch. Back to square one. This is entire little section here. I gained so much time on them. But then it gets really one lined afterwards. All right, let's see if I can make a run on them. He had the inside, but I had a decent run. I think I'm gonna try to get him in this 180 coming up. Or not. I had to get on the brakes super hard. Oh, we're back to fourth now. Fuck. And it's going to be the last lap next time by as well, so... I'm gonna try. I don't think it's gonna happen though. I don't think I'm close enough to get anywhere near a pass right, right here. Oh, just kidding. Using all of the track plus some. Oh, I'm in this guy's draft. Alright, so we're back into third. Uh, I think that's all we've got here. Okay, mate, you're on his tail. Let's try and nail him on this lap. Force an error. He's under big pressure. You can take him. I don't think we got anything for him. Oh, oh, missing a shift there. That's a podium finish. All right. Lovely job. Nice drive. Started second, finished third. Not, not ideal, but a lot better than last week. That is for sure. Um, so we're going to continue. And uh, continue.
So a first and a third. And we ended up getting the uh, championship in the Formula C, Formula C British Series. So bringing a championship back home uh, by almost 20 points. Um, 28, or 18. Uh, we're going to head back to the career dashboard. And so, like I said, a lot better weekend uh, this time around compared to last weekend where we got, like, I think we won the sprint race and we got last in the actual race. Uh, let's Let's take a look at our inbox here. Um, all right, nothing important. And once again, uh, a 1-3, not terrible. Um, I'd, I would have liked to get that 1-1, one, one, but, you know, we brought, we brought the championship home. Jesus, I cannot talk. Um, but that's going to do it for the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, uh, comment on the video, let me know what you think, and... It, as always, subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Kellen and I greatly appreciate it. Uh, we enjoy bringing content to you guys. I know I've been a little lackluster on the content here in the past couple of weeks, but we should be able to pick things back up to what we, or to what I was doing. Um, Kellen's got his stuff that he's doing every week, and um, of course we got the group plays c coming out every Friday. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys next week for Project Cars Career Playthrough. See you guys later.